Hey guys, um, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a basic tax calculator. Um, doing this tax calculator will actually teach you how to add and multiply with different values. So let's get started right now. To save some time, I actually copied um, like the layout of the form. Like I created it before this tutorial and I just copied it just to save some time. Alright, so we're going to open this and we're going to create a new project called Tax Calculator. Tax calc you later. Alright. Alright. So here's the um the, the setup I made. Alright. Let's begin. So basically the tax rate right now is thirteen percent where I am and it's preset to that already in the text box so what we want to do is we want to type in the price of the item and press calculate and it's going to give you the tax then when you press calculate again it's going to give you the grand total so what we're going to do is we're gonna press calculate now we're going to dim i as double and we're going to equal it to the text box one dot text right this is the text box one. Then what it's gonna do is it's gonna go I multiply equal by text box two dot text. Then text box three dot text is going to equal to I dot two string. So basically this is dimming the value I as a double and I is going to equal text box one dot text. So whatever you write in there it's going to multiply it and it's it's going to multiply it by this right by whatever is in here see text box two that's text box two and then it's going to show the string in text box three which is this so let's quickly demonstrate 23 bucks is 299 because it's multiplying that by that 299 is what you get now when we want it so that when you press calculate on this one it's going to get that and plus it by that it, plus it it's gonna add this with the price of the item and then give you the grand total so we're gonna go dim i as uh, dim yeah dim i as double which equals to text box um, just let me think, text plus one of text. No, text box, what is it? Whoops, whoa, 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 whoa. Um, text box three, all right. Text box three dot text, and then I plus equals text box one dot text. Then text box four dot text is going to equal to I dot two string. So it's the same concept except this is going to be adding with this and then showing in this text box. So yeah, what did I just do? There we go. Okay, so let's test this oh. Alright, so uh forty five bucks is gonna calculate five eighty five. Now pressing this button is gonna add five eighty five to forty five and it's gonna give you the grand total of fifty eighty five. Now let's add the clear function. We're gonna make it so that text box one dot clear, text box one, whoops, uh, three dot clear. We don't want the 0 0.13 to clear. Text box four dot clear. All right, so 145 bucks is that, plus that. Let's clear that, that, that. All right, so that's our tax calculator. It's very simple. There's only two methods of code. Uh, three, well, the clear button too. So let me re-explain this. So this is dimming the I value as a double, and the double is gonna is equal to text box one not text, the text value of the first text box. Then it's gonna grab the value of the text box one and it's gonna multiply it by text box two. Then it's going to put the answer in text box three. That's what i dot two string is, because i is text box one. Like when they are multiplied together, it's going to add that into text box three. <sighs> so
So yeah, same concept here except it's addition. And yeah, so that's a basic tax calculator. If you guys want any help or if you have any questions about addition and multiplication and subtraction or whatever, uh, just drop a comment and I'll try to help, bro. Alright, so uh, thanks for watching. Uh, see you next time.